Cyrus just exploded. The following is a Tornado Tag Team match. Introducing first from India, weighing in at 348 pounds, the Great Carry. One of the most dangerous and threatening individuals in all WWE. On that, we can agree, Cole. Well, the WWE Universe doesn't sound like they agree. Well, they also don't sound like they have two brain cells to rub together between the thousands of them, Saxton. That's not nice. A competitor who always has his game face on, ready for a major battle. The dead man has returned. The entire WWE Universe is in absolute awe. What a moment. And his partner from Death Valley, weighing in at 309 pounds, The Undertaker. At WrestleMania, The Undertaker has the most revered undefeated streak ever. Icons have been slain. Legends destroyed. Listen to the list. Kane, Orton, Edge, Michaels, Triple H, Cena, all have fallen to The Undertaker at WrestleMania. Even the showcase of Immortals is overcome by darkness. The Phenom's opponent has got to know that the end is near on the grandest stage. Surreal moment here tonight. An awe-inspiring, truly frightening sight. The Undertaker's opponent better get ready. He's about to meet his maker. The title collector is here. And from Miami, Florida, weighing in at 265 pounds, the WWE United States Champion, The Rock. 
Only a small handful of WWE superstars have held two championships simultaneously, and this man now joins their ranks. Yeah, it's an honor no matter how long you hold both titles, but the reality is most double champions lose at least one title before long. This man is determined to be the exception rather than the rule. You talk about standing at the top of the mountain, this guy is at the peak of Mount Everest. Indeed, it is going to take a monumental effort to take either one of this guy's titles. Here comes the head of the table, the Tribal Chief. And representing the Bloodline from Pensacola, Florida, weighing in at 265 pounds, the WWE Universal Champion, Roman Reigns. The head of the table is at the showcase of the Immortals. We've seen Reigns defeat the all-time greats here at WrestleMania. Edge, Triple H, the Undertaker. But there's no bigger win than winning the biggest WrestleMania match in history, unifying the WWE and Universal titles by defeating Brock Lesnar. The Tribal Chief of the Bloodline showing off all of his hard-earned gold. And if you're hoping to take either of those titles, good luck. Byron, for any viewers at home who may not know, what exactly is a Tornado Tag Team match? It's a tag team match. Minus the tops. Everybody is winning at the same time, which means at any given moment, you could be witnessing a tag team match, a handicap match, or depending on whether these teams are going to win, even a fatal forward. Look at this, just what a barrage of stops. Fading. The official. And breaks out of the 
sleeper. Got him set up in the corner of the ring. And that canceled that Reigns offense. Able to reverse that one. Brilliant countering by both the players. Send him up for the flat line. He leaves the ring and there's no count outs in this one. And now gets tossed into the ring. Oh, what a shot. Oh, man. Rock. Trapping the arm. Vicious stomps to the hand. Close fist connects. Impressive counter. Step up and he throws it Nice and done. Solar plexus. One after the other. 
Uh oh. Kick out taking so much effort. Hooked up. Team is on the docket, the mayhem multiplies. Here's the proof. Here are your winners The Rock and Roman Reigns. It's The Rock leading the team to victory. I was so impressed with how well these guys adapted to the tornado tag stipulation.